Michelle Mack and her husband, Kenneth. Picks shows arrest of suspected mastermind in $8 million theft ring targeting Sephora and Alta. Michelle Mack and her husband are seen arrested after she's accused of paying as many as 12 women for their travel expenses, as well as providing them with a list of retail stores across the country to target, including stores in 21 countries across California. Dressed in pink loungewear on the early morning of December 6, 2023, Michelle Mack and her husband Kenneth were handcuffed and escorted into squad cars from their Bonsell mansion. CNBC's cameras were at the home as the arrest happened. The Max home is equipped with its own vineyard and chapel that the couple rented out as wedding venue and an Airbnb. But according to a search warrant, the home also doubled as a stash house for a small fortune and makeup stolen from major retail stores across the country like Sephora and Alta. She looks pissed that she's caught. And her husband looks like he's confused, but he knows what's going on. This is a top priority for me, primarily because of the safety and security risks it brings to our team, said Alta Beauty CEO Dave Kimball. Kimball talked to CNBC's Courtney Reagan about the investment his company has made in security shelves as well as security and trauma training, in addition to the wave of theft hitting retail stores. The network she built across the country was impacting multiple stores, and so by eliminating that, it's a step. But unfortunately, I know there are others out there just like that. Michelle Mack, 53, and her husband have pleaded not guilty to charges of conspiracy, grand theft, and receipt of stolen property. With all that stuff in their house? Hmm. Michelle is accused of working with as many as 12 women, providing them with a list of items to steal from stores across the country, places like Lens Crafters in Claremont and Alta Beauty in Miramisa. According to the search warrant, the goods were sometimes mailed to a Bonsal post office and ended up for sale at discounted prices on an Amazon storefront called Online Makeup Store. This is what they found inside her home. And this is her million dollar home. We have people that have stolen 54 times. It has become really rampant, said District Attorney Summer Stephan. It's one of the reasons why Stephan and mayors across San Diego County, County are looking to reform Prop 47. The ballot measure made some nonviolent property crimes under $950 misdemeanors. Guys, please support the channel and thanks in advance. And remember to hit that like button on your way out. And remember, don't allow anyone to steal your joy. Thank you.